I don't think Auburn, Gresham, and Washington Heights are neighborhoods that people even really know about. Inglewood and West Inglewood sit just north of Auburn Gresham, and those areas are hit hard with uh, with crime, hit hard with drugs, and I think Auburn Gresham deals with a lot of those same problems. So in many ways, it, it looks and feels a lot like Inglewood and West Inglewood, and as you kind of move farther south, it begins to take on, I think, the characteristics of the neighborhood to the south. You know, upper middle class, stable community. Growing up here, I think it kind of gave me a really good, firm foundation of the mix of African American life here in Chicago. And it's not completely a tale of poverty and dysfunction, and it's not completely a tale of success and excellence. And perhaps one of the reasons why the neighborhood has never been one that has a name that is very distinct in the minds of other Chicagoans is because you can't really put your finger on one particular type of person uh, or uh, uh, people that describes the neighborhood because it's got such a, uh, a mix of, of different kinds of people. I rarely hear the names of neighborhoods on the South Side. But when things happen, on the north side of Chicago, I hear Wicker Park and Ukrainian Village and Rogers Park and Center Square. And I, you know, I rarely hear Auburn Park. I rarely hear Gresham. There's some distinct differences between those neighborhoods, but you'd never know it. And it just becomes this one big amount. You know, it's, it's the south side. And, you know, there are communities, communities have character, uh, and it's important to give those communities an identity. Thank you.